What makes you a teacher of the ministry is your ability to interpret the voice of God. The prophetic ministry is not about hearing God, but it's about interpreting Him. A prophet is not just a man who hears. Everybody can he hear. A prophet is a man who interprets. As a prophet, if I see things happening in your life, I should be able to interpret what God is telling you with that God speaking. That is what makes the prophet the prophet. His ability to interpret God's voice with that God speaking. That is where we have the doings of God. That as a prophet, I have seen events. I can look at the way the earth is going, the world is going, and I can interpret what the Lord is saying. Because God can speak using events. You are are supposed to hear from God personally and as a matter of fact it is your birthright to hear the voice of God but immediately you become a prophet we are no longer talking a, about a man who hears God but we are talking about a man who interprets God so a prophet is an interpreter of God not a hearer of God if you are a prophet and you only hear God you are no different from a believer who also hears him so what makes you distinct in the office is your ability to interpret the happenings of God events, things around your environment, you can interpret them as a prophet. So until you can interpret the voice of God, even when he is not speaking, we should not call you a prophet. We should still take you through a class. To understand, you will be able to interpret that voice. There are many people, the happenings in their life, they need interpretation to it. Sometimes they do not come because they want you to hear audibly. People come to me and they say, I want to know, man of God, what is happening? So which means they need interpretation. They are not just interested in hearing God's voice. Some of them have heard the voice, but they did not understand the voice because they could not interpret the voice. They know that the Lord told them, be patient because this is your dry season. In five years time, I will establish you. But within the five years, things are so hard and severe that they need a prophet to interpret that voice. When the people were in the wilderness, they know, they have heard, the, do you think that they didn't hear the voice of God? They know, and they heard Moses speaking to him, to them. They believed Moses. That was why in the first place, they left Egypt and followed Moses to the wilderness. You should know that it takes men who believe in Moses to leave Egypt and follow Moses into a bush and into a place where they don't know their destination. But when they were in the wilderness, though God promised them Cana, but there was hunger in the wilderness. On their way to Cana, there was hunger. On their way to Cana, there was taste. On their way to Cana, they were beaten by snakes. On their way to Cana, the sun scorched them and the rain beat them. So it got to a time in front of the Red Sea, they needed an interpretation to the happiness there. They wanted Moses to actually tell them what is happening. That was all Oh, tell us what is happening at this time. We need an interpretation to this happiness. Though we heard the voice of God, there are people who heard God's voice and they started ministry. As I talk to you right now, many are watching me. They need interpretation to what is happening in their life. They heard God and they went ahead and started the ministry. But right now, they need an interpretation to what is happening in their life now. Because they, they can't understand whether they really heard God or it was another person who spoke. Many people have heard God and they have entered into marriages. Right now, they need an interpretation. In their marriage, they heard God before do you know why? Because they are confused whether what I heard was it God who really spoke or it was another man who spoke to me. So the functionality of a prophet is not his access to the voice of God. If that is your purpose as a prophet, you have failed. You differ not from an ordinary believer. Your ability is what? Your functionality is your when you begin to interpret. When you now gain mastery in interpreting the voice of God in the happiness in the lives of men, ministry, events, nations, and continents. That is what makes you a prophet. So your members are not looking to access God's voice. They can read the Bible. And one of the ways through which God speaks is the word of God. What is happening, man of God? I cannot understand. I can't seem to what? Decode the happenings in my life. I do not know what is wrong with me. Prophet, at that time, they do not need you to hear God. They need an interpretation. And as a prophet, multitude have come to me. I didn't hear from God. I listened to them. And after listening to them, I interpreted the happenings in their life. Now, 
A dead man walked to my office and he left my office a living man. Why? Because I just interpreted the happenings in his life. So the purpose of the prophetic ministry is interpretation. Not just hearing the voice of God, but interpretation. There are many people, can I pro? Can I pro? They have missed the mark. Prof. Eric, you were not called to prophesy. You were called to interpret. So if every day your purpose on the pulpit is prophesying every day, look, I'm telling you the truth. Somebody can receive a prophetic word today and tomorrow he'll commit suicide. Because the prophetic word will not align. It will not make meaning. Because the happiness in his life and the word you said is not making meaning. Sometimes they need interpretation. The sons of the prophets were brought to a level where they can discern activities in the realm of the spirit. They know... Watch it. These guys know that their father was about to be taken away, which is Elijah. But what they couldn't interpret is that when a man is about to be taken, it's a season of transference of mantles. Now, they could discern, they can see in the realm of the spirit. But what they couldn't discern is that they do not know that it was a season of transference of mantle. And it was not Elisha alone who could have inherited that mantle. We could have had 10 Elishas in his generation, and yet the generation will still need more. Every church in Bolga can be filled, and there are still unbelievers. So I don't know the hatred, the anger, the bitterness among men of God. They are angry when they discover that your church is full to capacity. Meanwhile, every church in this land can be full, and we still have unbelievers at the beer bar. Oh yeah! So we could have had 20 Elishas in his generation, and yet the generation will still be looking for more. Yeah. So interpretation is very important. If you can prophesy without having the ability to interpret, trust me, something is still wrong somewhere. So is it every person who should become a mentor in the prophetic? No, there should be a criteria for us to call you a mentor in the ministry. You should not just get up and start teaching. You should ask yourself, what I'm teaching, do I have it? If any of these people fall on me for interpretation in their ministry, in their life, will I be able to interpret or I will tell them, I'm praying with you. Because sometimes people don't want I'm praying with you. They need to know what is happening, man of God. They do not understand the myth. They can't interpret some things. They don't know what God is doing at that time. I have cancer of the stomach. I live my life for God. Tell me what is happening. Am I about to die? People have asked me that question. Am I about to die? I have prayed that God should take this thing, but it's not taken. I, I, I don't know. I don't know what God is saying. I don't, I don't care whether I'm healed or not. I just want to know what, what is happening at this time. The, this, this season, what is the season? What is, what is the Lord saying? Now, you can see a man looking for interpretation. So sometimes I'll go and pray and come back. And I begin to say, sir, this is what the Lord said. And the Lord said this, but he said, colleagues, a ministry couldn't give it. Now, interpretation. They couldn't give it because the prophetic ministry is for interpretation. That is the purpose of it.